please give a big, warm welcome and welcome to the stage, Huge Davies! Yeah. Keep fucking going. All right, here we are. Yeah, okay, it'll be funny in a minute, just wait, hang on. No, I don't, it'll be in a minute, give it a minute. All right, cool. Here's the first one. Here Walking down the street with my dad, he holds my hand, I look up, it's not my dad, it's just a random man, he puts me in a van. So it's part one <laughs> of, of three. So. The random man pulls off a mask. It's actually my dad. We both laugh and drive off down the road to an orphanage. He swaps me for a bike. Yeah. <laughs> part three's coming. It's got a happy ending. Promise. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The orphanage was just a dream I wake up in my bed But someone's painted all the windows black I'm in a sack I'm still in this stranger's van So, yeah Yeah Yes <laughs> uh, Yeah, a lot of comedians here, you know Are worried about the future uh, But I'm not I think I'm going to smash it in this, uh, you know, a lot of my uh, material is quite futuristic. <laughs> in the sense that, you know, it's not, it's not funny now. <laughs> but it could be funny in the future. You know what I'm a lot of artists have been working in the future. The best artists work in the future. Do you remember, do you remember this song in the about the future? Good enough. I said I've been to the year 3000. Not much has changed, but they live on the water. And your great, great, great granddaughter. It's pretty fine. It's pretty fine. That's the most depressing song I've heard in my entire life. Yeah. To recap, that's a song about someone from the year 2000, going to the year 3000, to have sex with your great, 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 great granddaughter. Yeah. Number one. If you've got year 3000 and everything's underwater, maybe the rest of the song should be about climate change. Yeah? <laughs> That's like if Neil Armstrong went to the moon and went, oh, Neil, what was it like on the moon? And he goes, he goes the moon? I'd say what's like on the moon. Yeah. Went to the moon. Went to the moon, yeah. There was no gravity But I saw some rocks that looked just like some titties No <laughs> That's my great-great-granddaughter you're talking about there, mate <laughs> Gonna sleep my relatives You gotta keep it to yourself you know? I thought it was a fun song about time travel Not Russell Brand the musical yeah. <laughs> And for those of you who've, who've not done the maths, right? For it to be possible in the year 2000 to even have a great, 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 great granddaughter in the year 3000, you're gonna to have to spread 1,000 years over five generations. <laughs> that, that means if she was alive, yeah, and I hope to God she was. <laughs> if she was alive and you average out all the years over the generations, She's going to have a lifespan of a, at least it's, it's two centuries. <laughs> at this point, she's the oldest woman in the world. At this point, she's... She's... She's what? She's not pretty fine. Her, her blood is literally dust. <laughs> Living off a drip. She's in a hospice surrounded by her family. Give her some goddamn dignity and death. <laughs> two, 2002 was the year society asked and busted. What's it like in year 3000? And the best answer you could have got was, well, everybody may have drowned. We still managed to gangbang a 200-year-old record breaker. <laughs> Not my future. Not my future. 
I've um, been thinking a lot about this song. <laughs> Have you? <laughs> uh, anyone know what that song is called? Anyone? The Entertainer. The Entertainer? It's, it's a good guess. Um, it's not. It's actually um, it's called uh, Entry of the Gladiator. <laughs> Entry of the Gladiators. The person, right, composed that, thought to himself, yes, that'll be the gladiators coming, and here they come. And his mates were like, listen, your best friends, your honest friends. And, we, and honestly, we're going to tell you right now, it's got more of a clown vibe. <laughs> what you've done is you've written a song about the circus, and that's fine. Just move on, and we might have to mention this again. Just listen to a song about the circus, and he goes, yes, the circus, of course. Of death. <laughs> Here they come, all 13 of them, climbing out of a Mini Cooper, here they are. It's too fun, you know, for gladiators, you know. Fun at any tempo, speed it up, someone on a chair, having a great time on cocaine, is like. Slow it down, someone on a chair, having a great time at a Jewish wedding, it's like. Much better than the songs we have for gladiators nowadays. You ever, ever seen a gladiator die before, mate? No? Well, it's very disappointing. Uh, same thing happens every single time. Basically, what happens is uh, they'll, get, they'll get stabbed, they'll fall to their knees in slow motion. For some reason, this music will happen every time. It goes, it goes. Depressing. It's depressing. They say your life lasts before your eyes when you die. If I heard that whilst I was being killed to death in an arena with swords, I'll tell you what, I feel very half class full about the situation. <laughs> Keep it light, you know? You don't hear that on casualty, do you? You don't get someone falling off a ladder in slow motion. Like this. <laughs> Just a Bristol builder called Ted walking through a field, touching all the wheat with his fingers, like... <laughs> one's too slow, one's too fun, you've got to meet me in the middle. You know, take, for example, this classic scene, you could be like... Um, My name is Maximus Decimus Marilius, leader of the Northern Armies, loyal to the true emperor, Marcus Aurelius, father to a murdered son, husband to a murdered wife, I will have my vengeance in this life or the next. Are you not entertained? You know, whatever. Um, all right. I prefer you. I do. Um, all right, it's probably the end. Uh, I haven't gigged in about five months. So that was right. Um, no, that's fine. No, that's okay. <laughs> please. Um, all right. Uh, uh, please, uh, you guys watching at home, whatever, uh, please donate generously. Please uh, keep supporting live comedy. Thanks very much. I've been Huge Davies. Good night. Bye. -bye.